Hi YouTube, hi subscribers. Uh, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to uh, solder a new ESC for your uh, speedboat. Uh, I purchased this one, it's a 200 amp DC 5 to 6 volt, 16.8 amps. This one, it's uh, rocker really. So, uh, of course, you need to purchase uh, these, uh, uh, what they call them, pins for uh, to connect to the motor. It depends on the size of the output of your uh, brushless motor. Uh, of course, uh, you need to have an iron. Uh, of course, uh, and then I've got I used this one from my previous one I had in my uh, pro boat, uh, Miss Geico. Uh, I'm just gonna solder, make it easy for myself. Solder the red with red and black with black. And then I will add uh, the female uh, pins here to connect to the uh, brushless motor. Uh, as you know, uh, I, I have a uh, Miskaiko uh, 29 inch brushless. I'm having problems with it. It seems like it's the ESC. So I have this one purchased uh, two years ago. Uh, so I decided to uh, change it. This one runs on uh, from 2S to 6S ESC. And it's uh, it has a calling system in it. Hopefully it will work. So I will uh, solder because I need my both hands and I will show you the result in the end. So now I have the female pins soldered in and then I will use the heat uh, shrinks to cover it up. And now I'm going to solder this ready uh, cable that I had from the previous one. Solder it together and then use a heat shrink with a tube like that. So here we are, I'm gonna use the shrinks now to cover it. And that's it. I'm gonna try it. Hopefully this time works with the new ESC. And if it doesn't, um, we will go back on the original ESC. That means the boat is not uh, working properly. Or maybe it's out of uh, order. I don't know really. I'm trying my best to run my uh, Miss Geico again. Thank you very much guys for watching. And uh, don't forget to subscribe and uh, press the notification button. Thank you very much. So here we are. I removed the original ESC. It seems like one of the diodes are burnt. Or maybe it's like it like this anyway it's not working when it's outside the water it's working when I put it in it, it cuts off so now uh, this is the reality the truth if all our uh, wiring is right we will check now we need to put on the receiver and then uh, connect the first battery How can I do that? Connect the first battery. Second one. Mm -hmm. That's a good sign. That means it's on. Rattle. Right, left. Power. Just make sure nothing.
And uh, tomorrow I will uh, check it in the water if it works and uh, make sure all the connections are right here. I know it's a mess now, but uh, it's uh, an experiment for me in playing with electronics. But uh, for the first result, it's good. Hopefully, this 200 amps uh, speed controller doesn't burn again because i had one 120 and burnt so this one is 200 and hopefully uh, uh it will be faster uh, this one these batteries are uh, two cells 4000 amps 40 c as they say it's recommended 50 c for the uh, pro boats for the brushless i've got of course uh, 50 c somewhere here mm. and i ordered a new pack of uh, lipos because i've noticed that i've got a couple of them that are not uh, charging very well and thank you for watching <coughs>